In this video, you'll see how to paint this bluebird. Free lesson at debwatson.org. Here are the steps for painting the bluebird. First, draw or trace the outline under your watercolor paper. Second, paint the background wet on wet. Paint the leaves with variety. Then put on the branch, the buds, and the flower centers, and paint the bird. This turns out well and makes a nice card or painting. Our first wash is the color of the bluebird and the sky. I mix cerulean blue with a little phthalo blue. If you'd like a little pink in the sky, mix a watery puddle of pink also. Wet the area behind the birds, the leaves, and the flowers with clean water. Load your brush with the blue and drop in some big areas. It should be wet enough that the blue will blend together a bit. You don't want it spotty. So if your areas of blue don't blend together, you can tilt your board or keep adding more blue. Your blue will dry lighter because you're working wet on wet, so you can add more blue around the bottom of the bird and the flowers if you want more color. If you want some red, drop it in while the blue is still wet and tilt your paper to blend. You can play with the color as long as the surface is evenly damp. Once it starts to dry, dry it completely, and you can add another wash later if you'd like. Dry well. Next, mix a puddle of light green and darker green. Paint the leaves with your two green colors and let some of them mix on the paper.
paint the flower buds red. and the center of the flowers a light yellow orange. Paint the branch with blue and brown and make it a little darker under the bird. To shade the flowers, you can work wet on wet or wet on dry. Paint the bird with the same blue as the sky, but it needs to be thicker with more color.
You can add shading with more or darker blue around the beak and back of the eye. Dry well. The breast of the bluebird is kind of an orange brown, but it does have white at the bottom, so pay close attention to where the white starts and the orange stops. Be very careful with the bird's beak. I'm just painting some black around the bottom of the beak and it goes over towards the eye. There's a little black underneath the wings. And you can add some black detail on the branch if you like. This is my white. You can also use white to clean up the flowers and the white part on the bird or the beak. I put white dots in the center of the flowers and added more red to the bottom of each bud. And that's it. This blue bird makes a lovely card. Happy painting.